What is going on, everybody out there in YouTube lands? Revolution on Cowboy here. Back of a video I haven't done in like, I don't know how long it's been since I've done one of these. Doing an unboxing video. And this one's from Amazon. Yeah, it's been a while since I bought anything from Amazon, but honestly, in this crazy time we live in, the, you know, still in a pandemic, even though things have started to get better, I haven't really bought much from Amazon because last year it was kind of hard to buy anything from them, you know. I mean, for a while I was able to find stuff in retail. But, eh, things have gotten crazier, and now it's getting harder to find stuff. I mean, I've had some decent luck, but my luck is not always that great. And as of late, I've found little to nothing. So I said, screw it. I can still find these figures on Amazon. I can still find figures on Ringside. And maybe, for decent price, on eBay. But that's all if it's a figure that I can't get, you know, ear off Amazon or from Ringside for decent price. So I'm going to open these up for you guys. Only have three figures here in the package, but hey, that's that's all right. And these are figures I haven't really seen on Ringside beat some price. Well, one of these I know I, I I have, or one or two of them I have, but one of them is like every time I see it on Ringside, it's like always on back order, and it's a little more than what Amazon wants. So sometimes Amazon's better, other times Ringside's better. So yeah. Anyways, looks like the figures are in decent condition. From what I can tell, these boxes they look decent. Looks like they put good amount of plastic in here. Keep it protected, so here we go. So first, this one I think Ringside might have for decent price as well, but I just said, screw it, I'm going to get it from Amazon. Jared King Lawler, very nice, from Elite Series 82. And I need one mock because the only other Jerry King Lawler figure I have is from Elite Series 18. I have that figure out of the package, so it's cool to have one men on card, especially since I've missed out on his other Elite Legend figure in the Hall of Fame set, so very cool. Of course, back of the box if you want to read it. There you guys go. And there's everybody else. I haven't picked up anybody else from Elite Series 82. Heck, I haven't picked up a whole lot of Elites in general. I'm trying to kind of get back into collecting. Obviously, if you guys see in the background, yeah, I was getting more focused on Pokemon collecting, but eh, Pokemon has been kind of even worse to find than wrestling figures. And if you guys watch my toilet videos, yeah, they're like impossible to find. So the next figure I'm going to get, I'm going to show you guys here. This one, yeah, Ringside kind of always has on back order, or they want like a little more than Amazon wants. So I just screw it, I'll get it from Amazon. For $19.99, here we go. Stunning Steve Austin. Before he was stone cold, and back when he still had, you know, blonde hair on his head. Very cool, comes with that Dose W tag title. I'm glad they're finally making the old Dose W belt, so maybe we'll see the television title at some point. Maybe we'll see the Dose W hardcore title. I mean, they've already made the United States title in a two-pack with Goldberg and Bret Hart, which I need to still get that two-pack at some point. Anyway, yeah, here's the back of Elite 81, of course. Once again, pause it if you want to read all that. And I've only picked up Bianca Belair. I still need to get, like, the Street Profits. Maybe The Rock, and, you know, even the Shinsuke I make it so getting. And also the Mae Young, but I can never find that figure. No, or anything in general. I mean, shoot, Miss Elizabeth from Lisa 77 is the only lead I see anymore. So the final figure, this one's from NXT. Well, that's is currently in NXT, part of the Undisputed Era. Kyle O'Reilly. And, of course, it's not the chase, but that's all right. Still a cool figure with that NXT tag belt. Undisputed Era shirt. Of course, Undisputed Era at this point. Um, from what I've seen in NXT, they're kind of having their little bit of a, you know, dissension, kind of a breakup as of late. Of course, back of the box. And then, of course, everybody else in the set. I still need to get everybody. Viking Raiders, Bailey. I don't know about the KO or Ricochet. I might, I'm, I don't know, I might get the Ricochet or the KO. I don't know, but I for sure need to get Viking Raiders and Bailey and... I'm going to probably end up buying some stuff from Ringside here soon, just because, yeah, I'm just starting to lose faith in retail. I don't always have the time to go out, so hey, look, 80, 81, 82, so let me lower the camera down a little bit, guys. Give you guys a better look at all these awesome figures and all their glory. But yeah, there you guys go. First unboxing in a while, and probably not going to be the last, because, hey, everybody's getting their stimulus money right now, I mean... It's your choice how you spend it. If you want to spend it on stuff you need or things you want, maybe a little bit of both. That's what I'm trying to do. You know, save money when I need it. But you know what? Hey, every now and then I'll buy some figures. You don't have to always buy all at once. I mean, probably next time I buy some stuff from Ringside, I'll probably buy a few figures, wait, hunt in retail, and then buy some more because, yeah, I don't have the time to go to Walmart or Target. And I only have to go to one Walmart anymore. And yeah. That's what we try to find AEW figures, but guys, once again, look at these awesome figures. Of course, cool. Kyle O'Reilly, definitely probably one of the most awesome figures here. Very nice face scan, of course. The Austin and the Jerry King Lawler. 
all pretty cool figures. So, short unboxing video, but, you know, long in a way. But there you guys go. Try giving the shot. But anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Rock on. Keep collecting. And as always, stay safe.